hello welcome to my channel so in today's video i'll be showing you how to make plantain moi moi yes you heard me right it's so so tasty and delicious it doesn't just look nice but it tastes very very unique as well so all you have to do is wash the plantain and take off the coat cut or dice the plantain into little pieces so that your blender can blend it with ease or you can use hand blender to blend it it depends on what you have at the moment so you use what you have to blend your plantain into a smooth paste um thank you very much for tuning in today if today is your first time of watching this channel i am mommy Ebechu, and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button okay and turn on the notification bell to get my video each time i upload thank you very much uh, so this plantain has been washed remove the coat or the peel as some people call it cut the plantain into little pieces blend you just have to blend the plantain with things you normally use in making your moi moi like crayfish onions pepper that's just it i'm going to use tatashi um the bell peppers and few scotch bonnets to give it some spice like to make the um plantain mama a bit spicy if you don't want it to be spicy so you don't add scotch bonnet you can just make it of tatashi to give the um plantain my my a very nice color or you can make use of um jello fry spice jello fry some jello fry spice actually um give a different color to um your moi moi so you can add it to your plantain when blending um so i don't want to use water to blend this plantain so i'm just going to push the plantain and every other thing i'm going to blend downward i'm going to push it downward to the blade so that i can make it easy for my blender to blend it with ease um just blend until you have a smooth paste If you don't have plantain flour at home, you can use semolina for this process or semovita for this process or so you have options. I made use of plantain flour because I want to keep this plantain my my in the family of plantain. I wouldn't want to use something else, um, but you can make use of um, semolina or semovita if you don't have plantain flour at home. I use plantain flour because it's more nutritious too so make sure you have a smooth um you make sure the plantain floor is smooth after mixing everything together i made use of two cups of water to mix the same the plantain floor you don't want a runny plantain floor so make sure you don't add too much water or you add it gradually so that you can get the right consistency
the plantain my my is ready i hope you learn one or two things from this video and i know you want to try this recipe please don't forget to share my video give us a thumbs up and if you have any question just leave it in the description box in the comment section i'm going to answer you okay i hope you enjoyed this see you in my next video bye